first, to my left, Dave Heath and Chris Proctor. Their opponent, the Iron Sheep and Rip Morgan. Will you take a look at Rip Morgan? There he is with the New Zealand flag draped around him. But take a look at that headdress. Can you believe the big Iron Sheik has got him? Oh, the Iron Sheik going across with that Iranian flagstaff. How Chris Proctor right back in the back of the head with it, and down he goes. What a way to get it started. We were trying to point out to you that the goofy New Zealander, huge Rip Morgan, was wearing that Iranian headdress that the Iron Sheik had him decked out in. We've got the team of Chris Proctor in the ring right now against David Heath. And now it's the Iron Sheik putting up those pointed curl toed shoes. Slams the head of Proctor right on. And in comes the big New Zealander. This goofy guy is in great company when he joins with the Iron Sheik. He misses the big elbow, but it doesn't take him long to change it back to his favor as he picks Proctor up, drives him down to the map, and then pounds him with that arm. Big team, the team of the Sheik and Rip Morgan. Hey, again, we'd like to remind you that this coming Wednesday, we're going to be over and looking forward to seeing all of the year. NWA fans at Little Rock, Arkansas at Barton Coliseum. Uh, that's my old hometown. As a matter of fact, I was born there at one time. But I also got to tell you that I am thrilled on what is, well, we could use a lot of superlatives regarding it, but I promise you, the NWA coming into the Mid-South Coliseum this coming Thursday, that's the 20th, with one of the greatest cards that I've ever seen. I know that takes in a bunch. It sounds like, oh, it can be true. You wait. We'll get into all of it sometime later on. But that's Wednesday night in Little Rock, and I am looking forward to seeing you coming up Thursday in the Mid-South Coliseum. It's an homecoming time. First time I've been in the Coliseum since joining the NWA. Right now, into the ring for the first time is David Heath, and he was treated rudely by the Ripper. Rip Morgan stomping down with that huge foot of his back to the corner. The tag on the Iron Sheet. The Iranian former Olympic champion moves into the ring, picks Heath up, belly to back suplex, dumps him down, and he may be going for the camel clutch. Oh, boy. Stepping in there, and if he can get it on him, can I tell you, it is all over but the county, Prince. He's got it. This will this will end up in a submission as referee Tommy Young says ring the bell, and that's going to be it. What a sensational win for the Iranian and the New Zealander. Hey, let's stay tuned right now for the Western Union instant replay coming up in just a moment. Dana? The Iron Sheik and Rip Morgan! Watching the Western Union instant replay, you saw how the Sheik slipped in all night, slipped in with a belly-to-back suplex, banged him down, then positioned him where he wanted him, and starts to move into that camel clutch. And can I tell you, think about 270 pounds sitting down on your spine and pulling up on the chin and all. A lot of trouble that the Iron Cheek has been in, but he knows how to get out of it, but no one can get you out of a jam like Western Union. Believe me, the fastest way to send money. 